Alrighty, so as you guys know, we're getting a collab, at least Nikkei is getting a collab with ReZero and a lot of people are like 50-50 on it. I've seen a lot of comments saying they're disappointed and I've seen a lot of people saying they're excited. It's kind of weird though, because it seems like some people are disappointed because of the characters that are going to come in and how the j jiggle physics are going to work for them. Um, and then some people are just disappointed because they don't like ReZero and then some people are excited because they like ReZero. I'm just disappointed because um, I was expecting this to happen eventually when DK ReZero has a lot of, you know, collabs with different games and that's actually what we're going to be talking about we're going to kind of predict what the characters are going to be in terms of the rarity and what weapons they could have and stuff like that right so uh yeah we did get it here we know it's ReZero the color scheme also matches Amelia, right? For anybody who does not know, let me pull up ReZero so you guys know. Um, I typed in ReZero Season 3, my bad. Where is the vid it pictures? Here, this is Amelia. Amelia is this character, right? Um, this character right here in the purple. This character right here is Amelia. White and purple is her whole thing, so we know that's the collab. Somebody did actually point out that this could be Epic 7, which um, their reasoning was actually kind of valid, right? If you guys take a look at the Epic 7 logo, if you take a look at this logo, right? The X they used is the exact same X, or not the exact same, but quite similar to the X that, you know, um, Epic 7 used, right? Not only that, if you look at the diamond here of the question mark, they said that the diamond is the exact same of the I in Epic 7. So, and the thing is like, Epic 7 doesn't use this logo particularly, so it could be a reach, but you know, maybe, maybe it's not, I'm not sure. Uh, but we're gonna be talking about, again, what characters are most likely going to be coming and uh, what rarity they're going to be. So first things first, let me pull up the ReZero girls, right? Because that's uh, the characters that are gonna be coming, right? I'm telling you right now, I believe the three characters we are going to be getting are going to be these three characters. Amelia, which is this character, the white and purple character. Rem, which is the blue hair character, the maid one. And then Ram, which is the pink hair one. Now, uh, somebody actually sent me a list of all the collabs that they know of that ReZero has been a part of and there's even more there's even more that's not here right but we're kind of going to go over this and break it down based on um oh we're going to kind of break it down based on you know the rarities and stuff they were in other games now just because they were a said rarity in another game does not mean that they're going to be that rarity when they come into Nikkei we're just using it to kind of predict so if you take a look here at um you know I guess here are some games, right? Let's read this. Hi, Zexus. I have compiled a list of the ReZero. This is from No Bunny. Shout out to No Bunny, right? Hi, Zexus. I've compiled a list of the ReZero characters in all gacha games I could find so you could potentially use it for a prediction video. Here are my predictions for the SR characters and rarities in EK for the upcoming collab based on prior uh, prior collabs, right? So, um, No Bunny here believes that Ram will be the free SR, Rem will be a gacha, a gacha costume plus SSR, and then Amelia will be an SSR, right? Without the gotcha costume, probably just like a side costume like what A2 got. Now me, right now, based on just common sense, I think it's going to be like this, but the other way around with Amelia and Ram for the gotcha costume. At the end of the day, Amelia is the main character for, you know, ReZero, right? I wanna say Rem is more popular than Amelia. I don't think that's a reach, but Amelia is the main character, right? She's like the 2B of, you know, ReZero, she's the main female character of the show. So it makes more sense for the main character to get the costume gotcha rather than Rem. But again, Rem's popularity is out of this world, right? Plus Rem and Ram look exactly the same. So it would be weird for Ram, or Ram to get the gotcha, the, gotcha, the, the gotcha costume and not Ram. But Ram, I do believe will be the free SR um, because if you take a look here, right? We have Princess Connect. They actually had Ram, but she was the free, um, you know, two-star character. And Ram and Amelia were both the free three-star characters, which in Nikki's term was a SSR, SSR, and then an SR. If we take a look at here, Alex Fiction, right? All three of these characters wear SSRs. Now we don't get free SSRs for anything besides collabs, or not collabs, uh, anniversaries, right? We've only gotten two free SSR characters, like from just logging in, and that was from the half anniversary and also the um, anniversary. Not only that, this collab is really close to the half anniversary. So I doubt they're gonna give us a free SSR RAM, or not RAM, RAM, and then we're gonna get another free SSR for the half anniversary. I doubt it's gonna happen. Um, so in Alice Fiction, they had all SSRs. In NND Compass, they had um, only, whoa. 
Okay, so, okay, they had Ram as the SR, and then they had Ram and Amelia as the UR. So, as you guys see, we've already seen a trend of Ram always being the SR. In Grand Cross, I know he didn't put Grand Cross here, but in Grand Cross, Ram was actually a free unit as well, right? She was actually a free unit as well. So, in most of these games, Ram, the pink-haired one, for the people who do not remember, this character right here that's sleeping, this is the character that's usually the free character in many gacha game collabs, right? If she's not going to be on like a banner, if she's not considered an SSR alongside the other two, she's usually, usually either the other rarity or the free character, right? So we already know that. The Sky RPG, right? Um, so they had Omni Rem. Now, if you don't remember, they had way more than usual, but Omni Rem, if you haven't watched the show, like they're demons basically, right? Omni is like, they have Omni forms and stuff like that. They're demons, like Rem and Ram, the maids, these two, let me remove this. These two are like demons. So we could have different forms, I'm not sure. They could transform, especially since we have Dorothy transforming, right? Um, in this one, we have Epic Seven. All of them were five stars equivalent to SSRs. In Kuno Super Fantastic Days, oh, they only had Rem and Amelia, not even Ram. So it's kind of guaranteed those two are gonna happen, right? Um, in Bang Dream, they had Amelia as a four star, and then I guess they had Rem and Ram as one character, both as a four star, so it makes sense, right? Illusion Connect, they had all three of them, all of them, you know, SSR again. Um, and then the last screenshot shows, uh, wait, is this the same one? Yes, it is. And then in World Flipper, they had four star for Ram, which is the pink here, five star for Amelia, five star for Ram, right? And there's other games, like I said, uh, AFK Arena had a collab with uh, ReZero, Grand Cross had a collab with ReZero, Grand Summers had a collab with ReZero. So many games have collabs with ReZero, so it's not unique like that. Hey, I'm just saying what it is. But yeah, so based on predictions, we can most likely assume that Amelia and Rem will be the SSRs, right? That's just kind of obvious, right? And then Ram will be the free SR, which makes sense, right? Um, they just make sense. Now, the thing is, she also has Puck, right? In most of the game, she has Puck because Puck is kind of like her, not necessarily her weapon. She can fight without Puck, but Puck is like her companion, right? So it's most likely like going to have Puck with her. That's what I'm assuming. She's going to have Puck with her flying. Um, which would be cool, but Amelia is probably going to get the go the gotcha costume. Rem is just gonna get like the you know event battle pass costume, and then um, Ram is not gonna get anything, right? In terms of their weapons, now it's gonna be quite hard because these characters are going to have guns. Now someone said they could have swords, but none of these characters use swords, right? Um, none of them use swords, so it's quite weird. Um, it's quite weird because. Rem, the blue hair one, kind of uses like a club. I can actually show, show you guys. Rem's weapon, um, re zero, right? She kind of uses like a club, right? This, I don't even know what this is, right? It's called the Morning Star, but I don't know what this is. This thing, she uses this thing. This little ball right here, you guys see this chained up um, ball. Let me open this up in another tab. This right here, this is her weapon. So, um, she could have this and be a rocket launcher like she could have this weapon and be a rocket launcher because then she can swing it um as the animation and that would be an aoe which would make her a rocket launcher i do see amelia being an ar it seems like when they have these collabs right and they've only had two so we don't have much to go off of but it just makes sense for amelia like i i honestly can only see amelia with an ar to be honest, I can only see Amelia with an AR. We can search up her weapon as well. Amelia, right? I didn't even spot her name right. But yeah, she doesn't really have, oh, okay. Well, somebody gave her an AR here, but she doesn't really have a weapon, right? Her thing is kind of just like, you know, she just uses her hands type uh, thing. So she doesn't really have a weapon. And then we can use Ram as well. I believe Ram uses knives. Um, what does she use? Okay, that's a flute. I think she uses knives, right? I believe she uses knives, if I remember correctly, which I don't know. But, yeah, it's going to be hard to say. I want to assume this character is going to be, the Rem is going to be Rocky Launcher, Amelia is going to be AR, and then she's going to be, give her SMG, she's going to be useless. Uh, so, yeah, that's just my predictions right now. Again, shoutouts to Nobunny for, uh, you know, compiling the list of the collabs that they could find. There's even more that they didn't find, but just just this alone shows you how much like, collabs there are. This game has a collab with it. It just shows you, right? But 
you know this take it or leave it i guess it's a collab at the end of the day maybe you don't have to like this show but at least be appreciative that we're getting a collab right um that's a tip for myself as well so you guys let me know what you think um let me know who you guys think is going to be the characters if you don't think they're going to be you know these characters if you think it's a different collab still let me know what you think it's going to be for now your boys the i'm gonna be out peace later